All right, guys. Here's the aftermath of me just running. This is my third try. Uh, as you just seen in the other video, I just loaded up for a hundred miles an hour. It went into uh, some high grass and uh, crashed. Um, the remote remote says 94. I had it up to 101, and my GPS said uh, uh, 98. So it's pretty close um, I was on a nice long straightaway um, and uh, that one this was a hundred mile an hour crash just bent the body a little bit all right broke the uh, a arm they're the same ones as a slash so I mean I have a uh, few extra you know I have all rpm ones so I'm gonna throw on rpm um, but for a hundred miles an hour, I broke the, uh, front, uh, wing, you know, the downforce wing. Um, it went into some high grass at a hundred miles an hour. It almost looked like it just cut the lawn at about 14 inches wide at a path of about, I don't know, maybe about 18, 20 feet. And, um, then it finally dug in and that's what snapped the wing and did a few flips. Um, this is the other side piece that goes over on this uh, this thing here. Um, you see it broke off a couple of the tabs. But for 100 miles an hour, it definitely took a beat and, and really not that much broke. So, I mean, I think it's pretty good. Um, you can also see that I added um, wheel weights to the front. All right, they're double stacked. Perfect. Did not lift off the ground at all. Um, you know, no intention. So I'll probably end up just getting a new body, not worrying about, you know, the scratches on the top of my body. But, um, you know, I got double stacks. It's, um, I think I got, uh, eight ounces there. Uh, they're basically wheel weights you can get from a garage. You know, they'll sell them to you. A couple bucks. You know, self-stick. They stick really, really good, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, and, uh, but other than that, I mean, the car was, the car rips. I mean, it's good. You know, it took... Took a beating at 100 miles an hour.